this is a score rail. How this thing works is you get a pulse from the scoring disc for every point that you get. What it does is it sends electricity into this coil which magnetizes it and it pulls this metal rod down. It's actually a solenoid. And every point the reel should spin. And as you see, it, it doesn't spin. And that's because this piece here is frozen. Okay, now here's one that I rebuilt. Okay, except I don't have the reel on it. But as you see, every time it gets a pulse, if you look up here, it's scoring. Now if I take this and put it in a frozen position like the most of them were found, all it does is go back and forth. You don't get nothing. It has to be there for it to score. Okay, another thing I like to do is, uh, besides getting that to work, is exchange the parts from player one to player six, because player one, you can see, let's see if I get some light on here, the parts are worn, okay? They still work, they work fine, but I like to exchange it with player six, because they're brand new, they're never used, they're barely used, you should say, and, uh, you know, doing that, it's a 50-year-old game, you're going to get probably another 50 years out of it. Another thing we got to do is you got to go over to strike spare steppers because right now they're frozen and they're similar to the score reels. It's the same same parts basically freezing up from old grease. So you got to take them all apart. And like the other ones, one is more worn than six, so I reverse all the parts. Then you have some other steppers over here. You have to go through and you know all your relays and switches. And anyway, next time I come back we'll be playing the game.